So Ethan, I'm asked by pain patients a lot, especially new cannabis pain patients, what terpenes that they should be seeking out to reduce their pain. And they, they usually are asking me both for what they should be looking for in the flower, but then also uh, most of them say, can I put it in my, my aromatherapy diffuser at the same time? So, so it's kind of a two part question. What, um, what terpenes are going to be best for chronic pain patients just to feel a little better in their human? And are there ways that they can uh, get that terpene in addition to then just the cannabis plant to help them really relieve their suffering? Sure. Well, this is one of those instances where myrcene can have a benefit on pain, but particularly at bedtime uh, because of its narcotic effect. Um, uh, this is not necessarily going to be the best choice during the day for the chronic pain patient. Um, alpha pinene has uh, anti-inflammatory properties. Uh, linalool is going to help with anxiety that's engendered by chronic pain. Um, Caryophylline is going to be a great choice in terms of being an anti-inflammatory analgesic in its own right. And, uh, hopefully synergizing with other components of cannabis, particularly if it's available along with THC and CBD, this is going to be a big advantage. So, so we've talked before about how myrcene is, you know, kind of a couch lock terpene, right? And so the, 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 the variety of terpenes that you just mentioned, if put together, you know, if, if you took that, you know, you'd be, you'd be sleepy, you'd be lethargic. This is kind of, that's kind of an end of day cocktail. What would you recommend for pain folks who need to remain productive during the day? Would you say those same ones but drop the myrcene? Or would you keep the myrcene and put something else stimulating like a citrine or something on top of it to try to help modulate it? Okay, so during the day, uh, an ideal mixture would be a small amount of THC, a larger amount of CBD, um, and uh, a little bit of alpha pinene to allow a clear head um, and maybe a bit of limonene for mood elevation, um, a good bit of caryophylline uh, to boost the uh, pain relieving properties. That'd be a great approach. Yeah. Good. And so if you want to learn more about this, you can find the link to Dr. Russo's Taming THC uh, paper in the first uh, comment. Thank you.